everyone, today's unboxing is for the monthly subscription service to She Reads Truth. She Reads Truth is a Bible study subscription service. Once a month, you get a new um, study book for um, helping you along with your Bible study. Uh, you can also get access to the She Reads Truth Bible app. And um, occasionally you get like free gifts and stuff that come with the plan. Since this is my first box with them, I don't know what else is going to come in it, in it. I just know about getting the Bible study book. The service is $20 a month plus $5.95 shipping. And if you're in an applicable area, you also pay tax. So I've kind of been watching this one for a little while. Um, I, I feel it's important for me to stay in the word and to, you know, keep, keep, uh, learning about God and the Bible and all of that. So, um, I liked the idea of getting something regular to prompt me to do that. So, um, I decided to take the plunge and go ahead and get this one. So this is the February, 2022 box. And let's see what we got in it. By the way, there's also the you've got the she reads truth. There's also a he reads truth. So basically, the um, the version for men. Okay, so I'm just gonna pull it out. Came in a nice sturdy box. I got everything packaged in paper. There's my shipping. Yep. Okay. All right. Let's move the paper out of the way. So the theme and the study for February is Lent 2022 come to life. Um, and then it's nice because it also tells you what ones you can expect in March. We're going to be studying the armor of God in April, 1st and 2nd Timothy. In May, this is the gospel and this is the church. And also you have access to podcasts. So here is, wow, here is the book. It is very thick. Wow, I wasn't expecting it to be so thick. That's, that's kind of cool. I mean, daunting, but kind of cool. <laughs> so this is a Lenten study of the book of Ezekiel. Ezekiel which I have not done too much studying on. I will tell you, I have actually read through the Bible a few times, um, but I have not done an in-depth study on, on the book of Ezekiel. So, okay. This says, Lent is a season where we consider our sin and embrace the life found only in the cross of Jesus. I'm sorry, the cross of Christ. <laughs> In the book of Ezekiel, God threads hope through prophecies of judgment against the Israelites while they lived in exile in Babylon. Although they faced devastating consequences for their actions, God promised to bring them back to his forever presence through a new covenant fulfilled in Jesus. During the seven-week Lenten reading plan, we'll move toward Cal Calvary with Ezekiel as our guide. and Along the way, we'll lament over our sin and re rejoice in the good news of an empty tune, tomb and a risen Savior. Join us as we prepare our hearts to arrive at Resurrection Sunday with a renewed understanding and sense of wonder at the gospel of Jesus Christ. Okay, so um, you've got who the book belongs to. You can put your start date. Okay, and then we have some introductions. Oh, it talks about how to use this book. I like that. So I can take a look at it. Oh, look at this. So basically you have four weeks. I think it was more than four, right? Yeah, seven weeks, a seven week study and each day. So I like that. That's what I'm looking for, something to kind of prompt me. Okay, so the seasons of the church. Here's each, this is day five. Oh, look, it's got a hymn in it, that's cool. So you read, you write some notes. Oh, I like this. Now, I'm going to point something out to you. Hang on, just a, in just a second. Let me take a look what else I got here. So it looks like I got, along with it, a, what do they call those, like art prints? If I can get it open... Oh, 
scare you. Okay, so I have a like a postcard size art print. It says, look, I am on your side. I will turn towards you, Ezekiel 36.9. Very nice um, thick cardstock. And then, oh, several. Well, that's the cardboard. We'll put the cardboard over there. Um, he is not here, but he has risen. Luke 24, 6, one of my favorite, favorite verses. Um, and I will give them integrity of heart and put a new spirit within them. Ezekiel eleven nineteen. 19. That's awesome. Nice Bible reminders. Um, I, I will say this. The book is thick and it is seven weeks. So, um, and it's a daily, going daily through all of the seven weeks. Um, that may seem daunting. So I just want to kind of put it out there that if you're, you know, if you can do that, that's awesome. Sometimes life gets in the way or personality gets in the way. Maybe you're not a personality that can do every day having that habit. It's a great habit. I think you should have the habit of being regularly in the Word of God. You should be regularly connecting. Well, you should daily connect to God somehow, but it doesn't always have to be in your Bible reading. It could be in multiple other ways. This is why we have a personal relationship with Him. So don't look at this and go, oh, well, I could never do that because you don't have to do, you don't have to do it every single day uh, at this time going through the seven weeks. You could, you know, do it when you feel to do it. Maybe you'd want to do it every other day. Maybe you want to do a couple days at a time. It's okay. The whole point of having the book is so that you can do it on your time frame. You don't need to do it on everybody else's time frame. It's your relationship with God. You work on it the way you and he want to work on it. So, um, gosh, I hope I wasn't preaching there. So, <laughs> so that is everything that I got in my February 2022 She Reads Truth Bible Study subscription service. I'm really excited about this. So I'm uh, going to leave a link down below to my website, which will give you a more formal review and pictures, and also to their website. You can check them out for yourselves. Like I said, they've also got one for men. Um, I think it's the same study. It's just like tweaked a little bit to be more masculine. I don't know. Um, but there you have it. Uh, if you like this video, please take a moment to hit the like button down below. And also, if you subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell, it'll let you know when I post these unboxings. And as always, I love your comments. Have you studied the book of Ezekiel? What did you think of the, the this service? Have you used it before? Um, or here's a good question. What's your favorite Bible verse? So, um, yeah, or if you just want to say hi, that's okay too. I love your comments. I read and respond to them all. Thanks so much for stopping by and watching. You guys are awesome. Have a great day.